Some kids go to the motion analysis lab to find out how to help with their walking. This video explains what your appointment will be like and all the different things that you might do. This is my visit, but everyone's visit may be a little different. When it is my turn to go to the motion analysis lab, I go into a special room with a mat table for me to lie on. The first thing I do is change into my shorts and take my socks and shoes off. The physical therapist, or PT for short, will talk with my caregivers about how I move and walk. The PT uses a special ruler to measure how my legs move. She also uses a tape measure to see how long my legs are. The PT will ask me to move my legs and measure how strong my muscles are. I have to lie on my back, on my stomach, on my side, and then sit up. Then it is time for the PT and lab assistant to put small black stickers on my feet and legs. They might also put sticker boxes on my legs to watch my muscles work. I will have colored wrap on my legs to hold everything in place when I walk. This will not hurt me. They will need to roll up my shorts and pin them in place so the stickers don't get covered up. Once the PT has put the stickers on me, she will help me to stand up. I will have to roll my shirt up so the PT can see my belly button and hips. Then she will put the stickers on my hips and on my back. These will not hurt. I will have to leave my shirt rolled up until my appointment is finished. Next, the PT will ask me to walk up a small ramp into another room where there are blue cameras with red lights all around the ceiling. The first thing I do in the new room is step on a scale to see how much I weigh. After this, I will stand against the wall and see how tall I am. I will walk without my socks or shoes on and the floor might be cold. Next, I will stand in the middle of the room on the blue line. I will have to stand still for 10 seconds. The lab assistant will take pictures of my feet and legs while I stand still. I will walk over and stand on a colored dot so that my testing can begin. I will wait for the lab assistant to tell me when to go and start walking. I will walk down the blue line on top of the squares in the floor to another colored dot. Once I am there, I will stop, turn around, and wait for the lab assistant to tell me when to go again. When I am walking, the lab assistant will record a video of me. I will continue to walk back and forth until the lab assistant tells me I am finished. Next, if the doctor wants to measure my footprints, I will walk on a special squishy mat. I will wait for the lab assistant to tell me when to go and start walking. If I wear braces on my feet at home, I will sit down on a blue bench so that the PT can help me put these on. The PT and lab assistant will have to take the stickers off my feet and lower leg so that they can put my braces on. Once the braces are on, the PT will have to put my stickers back on me, but this time they will go on top of my shoes. I will walk back to the middle of the room on the blue line and stand still for 10 seconds. The lab assistant will take more pictures of my feet while I stand still. I will walk to a colored dot and stand until the lab assistant tells me to walk. When I am asked, I will walk down the blue line to the other colored dot like I did before. When I get there, I will stop and wait until I am asked to walk back. I will continue to walk back and forth until the lab assistant tells me that I am finished. I will sit down on a blue bench so that the PT and lab assistant can take off all of the stickers on my shoes, legs, hips, and back. My caregiver will need to talk with the lab assistant and sign some papers. After all the papers are signed, my motion analysis appointment is all finished. My caregivers will tell me where to go next.